Hello, this is Alex from Exgility, here with another tip to help your organization achieve transformational results. Today we're going to talk about some of the key features that organizations are looking for in an enterprise document storage system in the cloud. We will specifically be comparing OneDrive for Business with Google Drive and Dropbox. I will also talk about the new OneDrive Desktop Sync Client tool and some of the additional features and benefits of Office 365 such as SharePoint. Let's get started. The following are some of the most common features that organizations are looking for in an enterprise document management system that lives in the cloud. First, accessibility. With many organizations having their employees work inside and outside of the office, it's important that they have the ability to access their documents from anywhere at any time. If you're on your phone, tablet, computer, or if you're in the office, at home, or traveling, you should be able to have access to all of your documents you need at any time. It is also very important that the system has a simple and easy to use user interface. This is particularly important for IT managers. If a document management system is easy to use, it is likely to have a higher adoption rate, which leads to less training for employees. This can save both time and money for your organization. Sharing capabilities can substantially help your employees get things done in the most efficient way possible. It is important that users are able to share documents inside and outside of the organization. However, IT managers need to have the ability to control the permissions for who can and who can't share documents outside of the organization. Many document storage systems have this ability, but when sharing a file, you typically have an option to share a link to either view, edit, or have full control over a document. So depending on who the user is sharing the document with, you have the ability to give certain permissions. Co-authoring is the ability to have multiple users edit a document at once. This enables users to be more productive and collaborate more efficiently than ever before. Co-authoring also ensures that there is only one version of a document out there and it avoids having users email documents back and forth as an attachment. Security is also very important to consider when choosing a document management system. You want to make sure that your data is not going to get lost or stolen and that backups are being made on a regular basis. Cost is another key thing to consider when moving to an enterprise cloud storage system. We'll talk about the various plans and the costs associated with them here in the next few slides. The following are some additional features that are found in some select cloud storage systems. First things first, seamless synchronization. This is the ability for all your devices to seamlessly synchronize together no matter what changes are made to which device. So for example, if you are to edit a document on your phone or move documents to various folders or create folders, whenever you open your laptop or your tablet or whatever other device it is, all these changes are going to be synchronized so everything will be the same on all your devices. Version control is the ability to track all of the various changes and edits made to a document over time and restore those versions if needed. Web authoring is the ability to edit documents in the cloud on the browser. Meta tags are various ways to tag a document with specific data to make it easier to find. Metadata is a way to autofill or prefill a document. So if you are creating resumes on a regular basis or whatever document it is, there may be half or more of the data on that document that stays the same. So you're able to autofill that document with that data, so you only have to change what doesn't remain constant. Workflows are a way to automate business processes to make sure that your organization is getting things done in the most efficient way possible. Social integration is the integration of social sites such as Skype for Business and Yammer. Notice that these are internal social sites, so only people in your organization can see what you're working on or share posts. The great news is that most of these features that I've talked about are available on most of the enterprise cloud storage systems out there, such as Google Drive, OneDrive, and Dropbox. The following are some of the key distinctions of Google Drive. 
Google Drive is known to have excellent real-time collaboration features. Other applications have real-time collaboration features as well, but Google Drive is known to have the most simple, easy to use, and diverse ways to collaborate. Google Drive also has great offline editing. Some other applications are known to have problems with offline editing, but Google Drive typically does a great job with it. Google offers three plans for Google Drive. The first is for personal use and it is free. You will get 15 gigabytes of storage, a Gmail account, and access to online Google Apps such as Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides. The second plan is the G Suite basic plan, which costs $5 per user per month, and it includes 30 gigabytes of storage, a business Gmail account, access to online Google Apps, and a video and voice collaboration with Hangouts. The last plan available is G Suite Business. This costs $10 per user per month, and it includes everything mentioned in the G Suite basic plan. Now let's talk about some of the key distinctions of Dropbox. Dropbox has excellent integration with Microsoft Office due to a partnership with Microsoft. This enables users to use their favorite applications such as Word and Excel with Dropbox. Dropbox is also known to have excellent synchronization across devices. Some other enterprise document solutions have issues when multiple devices are set up together. Dropbox is known to be very stable. Unfortunately, however, Dropbox does not have any real-time collaboration features. This can be a big drawback for some organizations since real-time collaboration features can enable your organization to be more productive than ever. Dropbox offers two plans. First is the pro or individual plan, and this is $9.99 per user per month, and it includes one terabyte of storage. The second plan, business, is for teams and it costs $15 per user per month and it has unlimited storage. Now let's talk about some of the key features and what distinguishes OneDrive for business. First, you're gonna get very tight integration with other Microsoft products such as PowerPoint, Word, Excel, Outlook, Whenever you go to save any of your documents, you're going to get an option to save it onto OneDrive and you can choose your folder or category where you'd like to put the document. There's also a OneDrive desktop sync client tool, which allows your users to sync your desktop, your downloads, folders, or any other folders that are on your computer to your OneDrive. So a lot of other organizations that we've worked with in the past, they tend to have a hard transition to OneDrive and getting their users to use the online cloud storage. But by having this OneDrive desktop sync client tool, it allows users to seamlessly sync their devices and sync their documents to OneDrive without them really doing anything differently at all. It can also act as a backup for your desktop so you don't have to worry about losing any of your important documents. OneDrive for Business is usually going to include Office 365 if you purchase with an Office 365 plan. You're going to get other features and applications such as SharePoint 2016, Outlook, online office apps, Skype for Business, and much more. We'll talk a little bit more about SharePoint here in the next coming slides. One key thing that a lot of organizations tend to have issues with is the trust and the security and availability of their data through OneDrive or other document storage systems in the cloud. Microsoft stores three copies of your data in three separate locations. Find out more at this website below, microsoft.com slash en dash us forward slash trust center. Here are a couple screenshots of the OneDrive for Business Sync tool. As I discussed before, you see how your desktop downloads, documents, folders on your PC are just where they usually are, but there's also now a OneDrive for Business tab where you can click and drag any documents and add them to OneDrive instantly from your desktop or from your Windows Explorer on your PC. You're able to store larger files and more files in the cloud, and you're also able to choose what can sync and what doesn't. It's very reliable.
Now I would like to talk about some of the various OneDrive plans. But before I get started, I wanted to let you guys know that we're only going to be highlighting a couple of the plans here as there are much more plans for various organizations on the link below. Please also consider contacting us so we can help your organization determine which plan is best for you. Now you can buy OneDrive as a standalone plan through two different options. Online plan one is going to be $5 per user per month and includes one terabyte of storage. Online plan two is going to run you at $10 per user per month and what you will get five terabytes of storage, as long as there are more than five users. And here are two plans that we'd like to highlight that include Office 365 and all the fantastic features involved. Enterprise E1 is $8 per user per month, and it includes an Outlook application with 50 gigabytes of mailbox storage per user. And Enterprise E3 is gonna be $20 per month, but it includes all the Office applications and all the E1 features that are listed on the link below. Now let's talk a little bit more about SharePoint. OneDrive for Business is for individuals, but Office 365 Team Sites, or SharePoint, is for teams. You can create various sites such as Project, Proposal, Contract, Human Resources, or any other site where Enterprise Contact Management is required. The permissions in SharePoint should be managed by Active Directory. And please see our other videos for more on uses for team sites. OneDrive, Google Drive, and Box are all great products. However, Gmail customers may prefer Google, and Office users may prefer Office 365. OneDrive is included in most of the Office 365 plans, and as I said before, with so many plans offered from Microsoft, please contact us to find out more information about the various plans. It's also important to understand your security and privacy requirements. Regulated industries such as financial services and defense may require advanced security features such as the Enterprise Mobility Suite from Microsoft. I want to thank you for allowing us to provide another tip to help you achieve transformational results in your business. We will provide links to our blogs and additional videos that can help you and your organization in the show notes or description in the YouTube video. As always, you can contact us at info at Thank you.